Wow, ladies and gentlemen. You know, I was just sitting here for years to think if I should do this. You know, just sitting here just thinking about if I should put this thing about Simple Bank out there. Uh, I'm going to leave this uh, article on the bottom of this description. I I'm going to leave this in the description, I meant. Uh, Simple Bank shuts down and goes away uh, awry, leaving customers without access to the accounts. Oh, yes. Well, there's one thing about BBVA and Simple you got to understand. There's one thing. They think you're a money launderer. They think you're out to get them. That's what Simple Bank was all about. Simple Bank was just really simple. They thought you were a criminal. And they shut your account down for no apparent reason. And they just ran like little coward dogs. They got scolded because they ate too much kibble. Yes. They just run away. And that's what they always did in their lives. The CEO ran away from his problems constantly. BBVA runs away from their customers constantly. BBVA is a horrible bank with Compass, too. Compass and BBVA, horrible bank. And then when they came out with Simple, oh, that was simple. It was just like, should I even, in theory, uh, in theory, I mean, work with these people? Oh, that's just simple. No. David was a type of person. The CEO. David was the type of person that was always fearing the world. Fearing the aspects of people. And what he did was thought every single one of you were a bunch of of cowards and money launderers. It was just like Lending Tree. I think, not Lending Tree, no. Wrong company. Uh, Lending Club? Whoever had the P2P loans out there? I think it was Lending Club. Lending Club had this theory that everyone's a money launderer and everyone's out to get them. That was Lending Club. And there was a good guy in Lending Club called Christian. He was a customer service agent. And he was the sharpest tool of the whole bunch of them. Because when they say, when they say, well, we just shut your account, you should go to another place. <laughs> or you should do this, you should do that. He was a uh, real piece of work. Uh, you know, people put thousands and thousands of dollars into Lending Club. And, uh, he tells you, well, you should go somewhere else. That's, uh, that was Christian for you. That was Christian. But simple, David, ooh, he was worse than the CEO of, uh, Lending Club. He was. See, David had this aspect that everyone was a money launderer, and everyone was out to get him. Him. Himself. David Hydrata. Him. And, uh... You know, they thought he was... Oh, this whole world is going into... They're not out to get me! Yes. That was Simple Bank. They had simple minds. Simple pleasures. Simple thoughts. That's why it was called Simple, ladies and gentlemen. That's why it was called simple because they had simple minds simple thoughts and they thought you were a simpleton my friends when they leave okay let's do what I have to say when they leave and shut accounts down when they shut down completely Leaving account holders with kid getting into their funds. That, my friend, is fraud. And you know what, my friends? I'm just reading this article. Um, 
BBVA should be held accountable for this whole situation. BBVA should be accountable. BBVA Compass, BBVA should be held accountable for what they have done. And David too. You need to put them in the ringer, but the problem is they ain't gonna do nothing. No, they're gonna sit on their butts and they're just gonna walk all over you like they usually did. David would probably go to another stand-up bank, internet bank, and uh, claim you're a money launderer or something else. But until next time, ladies and gentlemen, please stay away from these online banks. They're all con artists.